What is going on people of YouTube? My name is Koyo and welcome back to another video. Today is going to be the start of a brand new series running every two to three weeks called Charity Tuesdays. And if you're on Twitter a lot, I know, very, very original. I've thought about doing this for a long time now and now that football season is almost over, it brings a tear to my eye every time I say that. It also frees up a lot of my time. So today, we start this new series and I hope you guys enjoy it. Today's video, we are going to talk about Ditch the Label, who are an award-winning UK-based anti-bullying charity. The Brighton-based charity is founded in 2012 by current CEO Liam Hackett. Sorry for any pronunciations, just by the way, in any of this video. The idea of this charity was thought up in 2006 by Liam, who was once bullied himself. It started as a MySpace group, and then once he finished university in 2012, he officially formed the charity and got things going with it. On their website they speak of four objectives which are as follows. Number one, to provide initiative support, to provide evolving, innovative and comprehensive emotional, psychological and physical support to those who are impacted by bullying in offline and digital environments. Number two is to provide world class pioneering research to use our pioneering research to continually measure, evaluate and predict changes in the landscape of bullying so we can continue to improve and develop our services and share our findings with others. Number three is to collaborate. They work extensively with other organisations to help make real positive change for thousands of young people each year. And number four is to change the world. We are working hard to tackle wider societal issues that stem from discrimination and prejudice, from ways in which we view our physical appearance to the normalisation of hate crimes. It's on their long term agenda. Recently they've released the annual bullying survey 2016. In this 32 page report you can find key bullying statistics in the UK, the motivations of bullying, the impact of bullying, and a variety of other things. I'm not going to sit here and read the 32 page report page by page, but I am going to rattle off a few key findings for you here. They found that 1.5 million young people have been bullied within the past year, 145,800 of the 1.5 million were bullied every day. In the report it states that 44% of young people who have been bullied experience depression, 41% experience social anxiety and 33% have suicidal thoughts. Now as much as this label does support those who are bullied, they also support those who bully. That's right, and they believe, and as well as I believe after reading up on it, that bullying is a learnt behaviour. It's not something that you were born in the world with as a wee wee young child. Some of the main things that make people become bullies are as follows. Stress, family or relationship breakups, having experienced traumatic events, or even being bullied or abused themselves, which can range from being bullied in school to abusive relationships. And many celebrities have given their support and spoken to Ditch Label in the past, such as Bella Thorne, Gok Wan, and also Paralympian Hannah Stoddle. Again, sorry for pronunciation. And you can also give support to Ditch the Label as well, whether this is through donations, fundraising, or just word of mouth, telling your friends about it, posting it on Facebook, Twitter, MySpace, Bebo, whatever you're into, any support for Ditch the Label will be appreciated. With that being said, that is where I'm going to end today's video, and hopefully you all have enjoyed it. Remember, if you want to support this label or are interested in finding out more of the research they've done, what celebrities have said, any of the things I've mentioned in this video, head on over to their website, ditchthelabel.org. You can find all that there. With that being said, hopefully you enjoy the rest of your day. Remember, spread love and not hate, and I'll catch you all in the next video. Peace.